As Taiwan transitions into a super-aged society, the medical field is encountering profound challenges. Statistics from the Taiwan Medical Association reveal that the average age of physicians is 51.5 years, with obstetrics and gynecology, family medicine, and ophthalmology being the oldest departments. Those who come in now are mostly for infertility, gynecology, and cancer. Not many people have obstetrics and gynecology departments as their first choice. The average age of doctors, while not exceptionally high on a global scale, masks a critical issue, the uneven spread of young doctors across specialties. A noticeable trend is the preference among young doctors for dermatology and medical aesthetics over surgery. This shortage of young surgeons threatens the continuity of life-saving skills and knowledge. Young people are more concerned about their quality of life, so they don't want to be tired and are unwilling to be on duty in the middle of the night or perform emergency surgeries. In the long term, this will lead to a dangerous outcome. That is, the hospital would be unable to find a surgeon for emergency surgeries at night or on holidays. Director Chen highlights a concerning cycle. The acute lack of young doctors in surgical fields leads to increased fatigue and overwork for the older generation, pushing them towards early retirement. Our department of surgery is the most worried about the pediatric surgery division. There has been no one in the past 20 to 30 years who received traditional pediatric surgery training and became an attending physician. The core issue facing Taiwan's medical system is this uneven distribution of young talent. With insufficient fresh faces in key departments, older doctors are overburdened. Addressing this imbalance is crucial to prevent irreparable damage to Taiwan's healthcare services. Wang Yijie, Zhang Zheng, and Jamie Lin Pinzon, TVBS World Taiwan.